Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. The topic of our discussion is OMIM, Online Mendelian Inheritance in Man. Uh, this database is a genetic disorder database which catalog all the genetic disorder that are caused due to mutation in uh, DNA or gene. So you can access this database through NCBI, National Center for Biotechnology Information. This is the home page of the NCBI. You can <coughs> go to the N uh, OMIM database while clicking on this drop down list. So here's the option of the OMIM. Select this one, click on the search. So this one is the home page of uh, OMIM. <coughs> So you can access uh, a two-way information if you know about the disease and you want to know that how many genes has so far been reported uh, with respect to that particular disease so you you just need to type the disease name here in this search box and you will get the list of the genes that uh, that has been reported in the, that particular disorder the other way around if you know about some gene uh, and you want to know that uh, this gene is responsible for which kind of the disorder then you only need to type the gene name or the gene symbol here in this box so for example we want to know that how many genes has so far been reported in case of primary microcephaly So now here is the list of all those loci which has so far been reported in case of the primary microcephaly, autosomal recessive primary microcephaly. <clears throat> so click any one of the options, for example, MCPH25. <clears throat> so, so on this page, Primarily, just look at the summary table. So, this summary table shows that this MCPH25 locus is mapped on 7Q22.1. Uh, its inheritance pattern is autosomal recessive, and the genes, the gene that is reported uh, within this locus is uh, MAP11. So, by scrolling down, you can get uh, the clinical features, the inheritance pattern, the molecular genetics, in animal model, etc. Uh, if you want to know about the complete list of uh, genes reported for a particular disease, for example, in case of autosomal recessive primary microcephaly, then always uh, click on the first locus. For example, in case of microcephaly, we will click on the MCPH1, which is the first locus reported in case of MCPH1. So once we reach to uh, the page of the MCPH1, just scroll down and <coughs> just stop by this option genetic heterogeneity of primary microcephaly so here in under this heading you will find all the genes reported in case of autosomal recessive primary microcephaly so here you can read that primary microcephaly is a genetically heterogeneous disorder mcph 2 is caused by mutation wdr62 on chromosome this mcph 13 caused by mutation in the cdk5 rep2 and so on just scroll down and look at the last sentence that MCPH25 caused by the mutation in MAP11 gene on chromosome 7. So this is the last entry which indicates that so far in case of primary microcephaly, 25 loci are you mean by uh, 25 genes uh, have so far been reported in case of autosomal recessive primary microcephaly. Uh, secondly, uh, if you know about some uh, gene and uh, we want to know that this particular gene is involved in uh, which kind of the disorder. So we can also get this information to the OMIM database. You just need to type the gene symbol here in this search box, for example, TYR. So <clears throat> when you come to this page, just click on the TYR gene symbol. So this one is the TYR page. So according to this uh, summary table on the TYR page, this mutation in the TYR is responsible for all these kind of the phenotypes. So phenotype means the disease that is caused due to mutation in the TYR. And uh, against each disease, the inheritance pattern has also been uh, mentioned. So if you scroll down, <clears throat> you can also find 
the mutation, the, the most representative mutation in the TYR and the responsible phenotype that is being caused due to that mutation. You can scroll down or <clears throat> on the left side, you can click on this allelic variant option as well. So allelic variant means the mutations reported in the TYR. So here you can see that this first mutation in the TYR is responsible for causing the albinism oculopotamias. And here's the complete summary of uh, <clears throat> that mutation and who reported this mutation, what is the, uh, the actual mutation and uh, what are the, the phenotypes uh, that are being caused due to mutation in the TYR gene.